what's up guys welcome to techno review and today in this video we'll be doing a comparison between the redmi note 5 pro and the moto g6 so the moto g6 and the redmi note 5 pro cost almost the same but we have some differences in specifications as well as the performance and other features on both of these smartphones so in this video we'll be checking out the differences the features which is better in moto g6 and which is better in the redmi note 5 pro and at the end we'll be checking out which one should you buy between the moto g6 and the redmi note 5 pro so without further ado let's go Before starting this video make sure to hit the red subscribe button on our channel and also press the bell icon beside it as to get quick notifications of our new uploads. So starting with the design and build quality. The Motorola G6 has got a 5.7 inch LCD screen of 1080 by 2160 resolution while the Redmi Note 5 Pro is having a 5.99 inch LCD panel having the same resolution as the Moto G6. Compared to the Moto G6, the Redmi Note 5 Pro has got a bigger form factor but I personally prefer a display of 5.5 inch as it makes one hand usage of the phone much better. But if you are a fan of big display then you should go for the Redmi Note 5 Pro. Coming to the back of the smartphone, now here Motorola takes the flag because of the new premium design which they came up with the Moto G6. The Moto G6 has got glass back with Corning Gorilla Glass 3 protection while the Redmi Note 5 Pro has this unibody metal design which is kinda old on a smartphone in 2018. But here even it's a personal preference as some of you might not like glass back on smartphones because of various reasons like glass tends to heat while you're running heavy games or other tasks on your phone and also glass makes your phone look dirty with fingerprints everywhere. But in my opinion glass back on a smartphone makes it look much more premium than the metal design but having a glass back you always need to carry a case in order to protect it from getting scratches or other damages which is a downside. Also looking at the camera setup, both of them are having dual camera setup but the vertical placement of dual cameras on the Redmi Note 5 Pro looks much better than the design used in the Moto G6. But overall if you talk about the hand usage feeling of both the smartphones then I would say I give the flag to Moto G6 because of the curved edges at the back of the phone which makes the grip much better than the Redmi Note 5 Pro. Now let's talk about the hardware and the software on both of these two smartphones. Now Motorola always been very kind to its customers in providing quick updates and stock Android experience and the same trend continues with the Moto G6 as it comes with Android 8.0 Oreo out of the box while the Redmi Note 5 Pro being on 2018 still running Android Nougat. Xiaomi always tries to update their custom skin MIUI rather than actually updating the OS version. The Moto G6 is running with Snapdragon 450 with Adreno 506 GPU while the Redmi Note 5 Pro has got Snapdragon 636 with Adreno 509 GPU. So the hardware is much better and updated in the Redmi Note 5 Pro and thus it gives you much smoother and faster experience in gaming and usage of heavy applications but that doesn't mean that the G6 is slow it's evenly fast in daily activities and being it on stock Android you will feel no lag whatsoever but talking about the benchmark results the Redmi Note 5 Pro is much ahead in score because of its powerful CPU and the GPU in Moto G6 you get the highest variant with 4GB of RAM and 64GB internals. But when you're buying the Redmi Note 5 Pro, you have a choice between the 4GB and the 6GB model as the highest variant of the Redmi Note 5 Pro comes with 6GB of RAM and 64GB of internals. But the Note 5 Pro gives you a hybrid SIM slot where you can either use a second SIM or an SD card but in Moto G6, they give you a dedicated SD card slot with dual SIM option. So in G6, you don't need to sacrifice a SIM card when you're using a SD card. So overall, Snapdragon 636 gives much better performance compared to 450 on the G6. And thus, if you want a performance-oriented smartphone, then I'll give the vote to the Redmi Note 5 Pro. 
but at the same time if you like to experience stock android then moto g6 is the one for you now let's talk about the camera both the moto g6 and the redmi note 5 pro are having dual camera setup with 12 plus 5 megapixel on both the rear camera on the smartphones on the front redmi note 5 pro is having a 20 megapixel camera whereas on the g6 it has a 8 megapixel sensor on the front both the cameras take good quality images but the front camera on the redmi note 5 pro is better in portrait as well as selfies compared to the moto g6 while the rear camera takes almost the same quality images in both the smartphone but again the rear cam portrait mode is better in redmi note 5 pro talking about the battery the moto g6 comes with a 3000 mAh battery while the redmi note 5 pro has got a 4000 mAh battery now both of them supports fast charging but xiaomi doesn't provide you with a fast charger whereas moto g6 comes with a 15 watt fast charger out of the box now the extra features which you get on the redmi note 5 pro is the ir blaster which is very handy at times when you don't find your tv remote around you can use your phone to turn on or control your television or other appliances in moto g6 you get the dedicated sd card slot along with dual sim slots and also usb type c connectivity now finally comes to the price the price of moto g6 starts at 13999 for the base variant and 15999 for the 4gb plus 64gb model while the price of redmi note 5 pro starts with 14999 for the 4gb plus 64gb model and goes up to 16999 for the 6gb model while the moto g6 is available on amazon.in without any flash sale check out the buying links in the description and guys that was it the comparison between the motorola g6 and the xiaomi redmi note 5 pro now there are various reasons why xiaomi is better than motorola g6 and there are also other reasons why you should go for motorola g6 over the xiaomi redmi note 5 pro but now it's your choice which one you will go for as both of them cost around the same price but again there is the insane flipkart flash sale for redmi note 5 pro for which many of us is not getting the smartphone now the question comes which one you should go for between the moto g6 and the redmi note 5 pro so in my opinion if you want to know that which one i will go for then i will go for the redmi note 5 pro not only because of the performance but also because of the improved camera which is there on the redmi note 5 pro the portrait mode and the rear camera shots are much better than the moto g6 so that's it but if you talk about the design i will prefer the moto g6 so it's just like a tie between the moto g6 and the redmi note 5 pro so do let us know your thoughts about which one you should buy between the moto g6 and the redmi note 5 pro and guys that was it for this video i hope you guys enjoyed it if you did smash the like button down below and subscribe to our channel and don't forget to press the bell icon in order to hear a when a new video comes out in our channel Thank you so much for watching and I will catch you guys in the next one.